Before starting this practical, you must remember some few things like what is web browser, what is notepad and what is HTML language. So let's get begin all the things one by one. There are so many web browsers are available like Google Chrome, Safari, Mozilla Firefox, Internet Explorer and etc. A web browser is a application software which is used for accessing information on www or you can say world wide web when a user requests a particular website the web server a web browser retrieve the necessary content or information from the server and then display on your computer screen second one is notepad notepad is a simple text editor for microsoft window which is already installed your system why i am talking about this notepad editor because with the help of this software we can easily design our html web page now third one is the important part that is html language html is a standard markup language for creating web page html stands for hypertext markup language which describes the structure of web page HTML consists of number of elements or tags. These elements tell the browser how to display the content on the screen. So now, what is an HTML element? An HTML element is defined by a start tag, some content, and an end tag. Now I am showing with some example. Tag name, starting from here. Tag name, content some content and and tag make sure and tag always start with forward slash so in next i'm showing and explaining what is the basic structure of web page and how to design this basic structure of your page now here i'm designing the basic structure of html so first open notepad type doc type html enter this element define this document is to be html5 here 5 represents a version of html next type html this element is the root element of an html page then type head head close here type title title close this title element specifies a title for the document or web page next type body body this element contains visible content on the page means uh, all the tags which we are using while creating web page everything is mentioned over here like i'm type typing h1 h1 tag close this element defines large heading next p tag p tag close this element defines a paragraph then body close and at last html forward slash close now this is the basic structure of your web page so now in next with live demonstration i will show you how to create a html web page to display your personal information
so listen very carefully now again open notepad type basic structure doc type html enter html enter type add add close title title close here give some title give some title here i am typing personal information i am reducing the font size i am reducing the font size so it is easily visible to all of you let's go back remember one thing this title part is not visible in web page whatever you have mentioned in body element only the part is visible in the web page next type body enter h1 tag type biodata it's option you can write here according to your need press enter then type p name gurjeet kaur p tag close now again type p tag father's name manjeet singh p tag close remember one thing for every new line you need to type p tag again and again so type again p tag write down date of birth 34 december 1995 p tag close press enter again type p tag type roll number that is 1594 p tag close p again p tag again type p tag now address is moka another for new line type p tag then state that is punjab p tag close now close body part and then close html now after completely completing this step next part is important one save the notepad file with extension dot html or you can use dot html here i am mentioning extension name is extension name is dot html or dot htm is that clear 
so now save this file go to file click on save as give file name biodata so now type dot html or you can type dot htm any one extension you can use while saving the html web page click i am saving the file on desktop click on save so now you can see this is the file now press right click on the page and open with any one browser which is available in your system i'm opening this file with browser firefox now this is the simple design of your web page if you want to make your web page more attractive or colorful then you have to use some attributes this part this attribute part i will explain you in the next video